Hello, this is Carol at Rocking Horse Farm. This afternoon I'm going to be showing uh, some techniques for the roundabout baby afghan. In my previous video posted a few years ago, I showed two of my books that contain this pattern. They're called Pretty and Practical and Your Mid-Gauge Favorites. These books are currently out of stock. So we've made the pattern available as a standalone sheet. It's available in print form or PDF. We're going to talk about the circle here in the middle and how we get it to be a contrast color. To do this demonstration today, I've only cast on a small amount, not the entire size of the baby blanket. And here's how we start. Just like the pattern tells you, we're going to start with scrap yarn and then we do a ravel cord and we want to end on the carriage on the left. The pattern will say now one row of our main yarn going over to the right. The pattern is going to tell us that we need to unknit the four stitches on the left into the um, to make that round circle. And it's easier to unknit it if I don't have the needles all the way out. Let's put them right here so the stitches are in the hooks and unknit them like so. And I want my contrast yarn, whatever I'm going to be using for the stripes in here to be in the middle. It calls for an 8 inch piece to, to take off before you get started. To take off of your cone of yarn before you get started so you'll have enough to sew the center shut and pull it tight. And there we are. These needles are now in hold. And we're going to do four rows. Good example of not having it in hold, right? One, two, three, We're now going to put six needles in hold and we've had some people say they do not want the holes showing, the decorative holes showing on the blanket as you can see. And so we're going to show you how to wrap that needle so you won't get that. Come across and see how it's going to wrap. On the carriage side we'll do that. Each row One more. Use another way of wrapping would be like so. Putting six more stitches in hold as the pattern will say. Two, four, six. And continue with the wrap. The first wrap I usually do that. It's so easy just pulling it back and not losing that stitch. Just so far. So it goes under. And continue on to the end of the blanket. Then you will not get that hole. Six. Put in the contrast color yarn at this point and go across all of them. Put all the needles in work by just taking it off of hold and they'll all pick up and do two rows. Continue right from the start again. Two, four and hold. Changing your yarns. 
you'll have a lot of ends to work in because you'll have to cut it after each one. Okay, now you'll see where you won't really have a hole there, not like a large hole, as in the blanket as you can see right up here, the pink or the white blanket. You see the decorative holes, like a lacy hole. Thank you. Enjoy.